day two with Hildegard of Bingen. Um, why do we do this mystic series? So what do we have to do with these mystics, right? So to me, they are soul brothers and sisters. They're just as crazy <laughs> as I am about God, about grace, about love, about truth. And and since they usually lived before me or us, you know, centuries before, um, they really they really bring something eternal, something that's always true, no matter in what time we live. Yeah, like there's something that they bring across, an aspect of wisdom that is very helpful to us now, in every time, in any time. And there there's a grace and just opening to their words, to their writings and being with them. And Hildegard had God speak directly to her. Um, so this next section I'm reading you is, is God speaking to her and through her to us. I, the highest and fiery power, have kindled every spark of life. I, the fiery life of divine essence, am a flame beyond the beauty of meadows. I gleam in the waters and I burn in the sun, the moon and the stars. With every breeze, as with the invisible life that contains everything, I awaken everything to life. The air lives by turning green and being in bloom. The waters flow as if they were alive. The sun lives in its light. The moon is enkindled after its disappearance, once again by the light of the sun, so that the moon is again revived. And so, I remain hidden in every kind of reality as a fiery power. Everything burns because of me in the way our breath constantly moves us like the wind-tossed flame in a fire. So, in every kind of reality, grace remains hidden as a fiery power. And just take that phrase with you as you're turning within, closing your eyes, And sensing this moment, this reality, you know, the reality of your breath, of the air on your skin, of what it is that you're sensing underneath you that you're sitting upon. Maybe you have a backrest that you can sense. In every kind of this reality that is real right now for you in this precious moment, grace is present, hidden, that's one of the reasons we meditate, it's one of the reasons we sit still and sink beneath the ordinary shadow of the mind is so we can open to this hidden grace. It's not always blatantly obvious, like the loud noises of our world. It's more subtle, but it's a fiery power. We're just trusting this hidden grace, this fiery power inside of your reality. And let it take you into silence, into stillness. Yes, it is subtle and yes, it is hidden. But it is very powerful. Mm. 
And just let yourself be taken into this fiery power within this very real moment. And you can pause this video now and turn it back on when you're ready to come out of your meditation time. Just taking one more breath into this fiery power of grace. opening your eyes and welcoming what you're seeing, what you're aware of on the outside, everything being a light with this grace. And keep that kind of vision open as you're going about your busy day <laughs> or, or the activities of your day. Blessings.